Hi, this is problem 13 of the AMC 12A. A league with 12 teams holds a round-robin tournament, each team playing every other team once. Games are either victory or end in a draw. A team scores two points for victory, one point for a draw. Which of the following is not a true statement about the list of 12 scores? Now, this word problem is a little too complicated for my brain, so I like to try to come up with a simpler example to try to examine some of these statements. So let's consider a smaller tournament of say six teams. So let's draw a table for how that would look. And we have our six teams. And teams don't play each other, so let me block those out. And let's see, so for match two versus one, let's let two win and one uh, lose. And let's just organize it so that we can add the columns to find the total number of points for each team. Uh, three versus uh, one, let's call that a draw, just for example. Three versus two, let's call that a draw. Four versus one, let's let four win. Uh, let's let uh, two win this match. Let's call this match a draw, and let's call this match a victory for six. So let's add them up. One, one, two is four. Two, 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 one is seven. One, 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 five. Two, zero, one, 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 four, five. Two, two, five. Okay, now let's examine these statements. There must be an even number of odd scores. Okay, that seems to be true, so let's just call this tentatively correct. There must be an even number of even scores. Well, in this example, that's also true. Let's call that tentatively correct. Uh, there cannot be two scores of zero. So I can see how I could have constructed this, this example to have, say, team number four lose all of its matches, but then by necessity, all the other teams must have won at least one match, and so uh, this statement is in fact true. The sum of the scores must be at least 100. So in this case, I have 15 matches, and that corresponds to uh, six teams taken two at a time. So that's 15 matches, and two points are accrued for each match. So that's a total of 30. If we had the full 12 teams, then we'd have C12, which is uh, 11 times 12 divided by 2, times two points accrued for each match. So that's equal to 11 times 12, 132. So that's the sum of all the scores for 12 teams, and that's greater than 100, so this statement is true as well. The highest score must be at least 12. So let's see here. In this case, with six teams, uh, I could get the lowest score for all of the teams by placing ones in each of these boxes. So if I basically made draws for every single match, I can see how I would get sums of five for each of these columns. And if I had an expanded tournament of 12 teams, then I could create draws for all the matches, and then the sums for each of the matches, or the sums for each of the teams, would be 11. And that actually would contradict this statement. And so we could get a score of 11 for all the teams, and that violates statement E. So that, in effect, is not the true statement, and our answer is, in fact, E for this uh, problem.